Hey everybody, this is Man Bear Squirrel from the Man Bear Squad, and here I'm going to show you how to do all the glitches and cheats you want to do on all your personal favorite games. And the trick about this is that you aren't going to be connected to Xbox Live while you do this, so all the online glitches, uh, they sadly have been permanently patched. But what you're doing by doing this is when you, uh, when you remove the patches, you are able to play offline, so if you want to play in a, a solo game, for example, World at War, you can play uh, in Nazi Zombies and do all your favorite glitches. However, this won't count for leaderboards as you're not connected to Xbox Live, but it will still uh, supply you with quite a bit of fun and it might even help you get some achievements. I'm not sure if they'll be unlocking, but if they're able, then there you go. It's just one more free way to do it. But here we are at the My Xbox tab, and then scroll all the way to the back, go to System Settings. Now, if you have a hard drive, you're going to want to uh, you're going to want to press Y on it. If you uh, just have a memory unit, then press Y on that, and it'll go to the Device Options. Now, for the newest version of the dashboard update, where uh, the middle button will look like this, if you have this, then uh, you're, uh, it's going to show up to, uh, for you as Format. And you're going to want to click on this and it's going to tell you that this will remove all content on this device now it'll 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 uh it'll remove all the things including updates but what you can do is with clear system cache this will remove only the updates it won't remove any of your content and all of that will be fine so it's just called maintenance and so to make sure that you have all the newest updates and none of the old updates to keep your hard drive going at its best it removes all of them so that the uh, the next time you load up your game, it'll uh, it'll only update for the newest one and none of the old ones. But what you can do is you can leave it to where all of them are off, and uh, go play on all your games solo or uh, with a friend, uh, like on your on that same console. And you can do uh, certain glitches and cheats that aren't available uh, when you have the patches active. So personally, I've already performed maintenance, and I don't want to have to update each of my games again, but that is the example of what you're going to want to do. And so in, uh, in all of your games, after doing that, you should be able to do all those little tricks and cheats as, uh, as you want. So if you like this video and you want other how-tos for your Xbox 360 or PC, then please rate, comment, and subscribe. See ya.